Oh, hi there. Um, I was just writing some notes uh, for my upcoming book in my uh, in my uh, little journal there for my uh, the book I'm planning, The Princess of Anya. Got some great secrets in, in that book for people to see. Um, now, uh, in this video, which is something new I'm starting, I'm going to try to get more into the realm of YouTube because people these days are too lazy to read words. So just sit back, relax, and listen to me talk, and it's a lot easier. So um, now the, the primary reason for this video is I wanted to discuss the secret to becoming a great author. And I know there's a lot of books out there and there's a lot of websites out there that uh, give you some guidelines about, you know, how to, you know, craft a good story and how to, uh, how to, you know, all the techniques, the do's and don'ts of, of, of writing a novel. And I'm here to tell you all that's bullshit. Yeah, just take those books and throw them in the garbage because I have the real secret to, to becoming a great author. And, uh... And actually, it has to be a video because I really can't tell you the secret. I have to show you the secret to become a great author. So, hear this. <clears throat> See this book? You should read it. Then we have <clears throat> this book here. This will also help you become a, a great author. And... Also, this book will help you become a, a great author. And this will help you become a great author. And this will help you become a great author. And this will help you become a great author. And this will help you become a great author. And this will help you become a great author. And this will also help you become a great author, okay? And maybe you can read my book, The Dark Age of Anya, that, that could also make you become a great author, okay? So basically, this, this, this uh, here will help you become a great author. These books here. Don't read guidebooks, read these. Uh, it doesn't have to be exactly these books. It could be any books that, that you love, any books that, that you find to be uh, meaningful, uh, that move you emotionally. Uh, basically, the point is, you have to read a lot. That's step one. It's a two-step two system. Step two is also something I have to show you. So this is uh, part of step two is this here, The Princess of Enya, okay? You don't have to read this though. That's for me to read. But uh, you also have this here. And let's see what else we have. And this. And this, this is a little book of poetry uh, I wrote in high school, okay? Um, and what else we got here? I can't forget. We can't forget this here. Okay? This here. See, it's filled with words. Okay? Now, you're probably wondering, what is all this stuff? Are these rules? No, they're not. What these are, are stories that people will never read. Or look at. It's basically what I like to call practice. And it's taken me thousands of hours, you could say maybe 10,000 hours, to write all this. And as you can see, it's single space. Uh, no double spacing here. It's all stories that I wrote in high school. In my youth, 
that will never be seen by anybody, okay? And this is just something you have to get used to. Here, uh, you know, I wrote these in, when I was in high school with my, uh, just have my dot matrix printer here. No laser printers here. This is dot matrix, okay? And uh, also, let's see, I got some more stuff here. Also this, and uh, there's no copies here either. This is all, this is all original stuff. And uh, I wrote this stuff between the ages of six and 40. And all this will make you a great author, you see? And there's more, it just, it just keeps on going. See? See, I know it's adventures, see? All this here. And kind of like we're going like back in time here. Back in time. Um, this stuff here. This is the secret. 10,000 hours or so of practice telling stories. And when you, uh, when you have compiled a list uh, thousands of stories like this, then you'll probably be pretty good. You'll probably know a little something about storytelling after, after all this, you see, after all this, you'll, you'll have an idea what, uh, what to write about and how to tell a compelling story. So, this is it, folks. This is the secret to uh, to good storytelling. And uh, if you are willing to to uh, to go to go the distance and uh, to do the work to put in the hard work, uh, you can be a great author. So I'm just you know I'm really tired of you know people thinking, hey, you know what? Uh, you know, I know how to type, I know how to write an email, so uh, how hard can it be to write a novel? Well, it's, it's just like any uh, form of art. If you want to be a, a great painter, you have to paint a lot. If you, if you want to be a, a master violinist, you don't just pick up a violin and, and you know, play uh, for a few weeks and then uh, hope to get a record contract or hope to play for the London uh, Symphony. You know, you need to put in the hours to become a master. And writing a book and being a novelist is an art form, just like painting, just like playing the violin. It's the same thing. And uh, and so, and, and this is the proof that this is what you need to put in. So if you're prepared to do this, then I think you too can become a great author.